What's up everybody welcome back for another video if you're new here hi my name is Yvette and on this channel we are talking about photoshop photo manipulation photo editing and so don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you want to see some cool video like this in the future so sit down let's go so as with this manipulation in two videos, the first one I will dig with the subject and the other one I will dig with the environment and the other stuff. I didn't want to make it in a single video, it become too long and it will probably get a bit boring to watch so I didn't want that. And if you like I edit your photo or use it for my next video, feel very free to submit your photo and I will be really glad to edit your photo, no payment is required. so. All the information are in the description. Now let's open it up Photoshop. Here in the wonderful world of Photoshop, the first thing I need to do is a good selection on the subject. You can use whatever you want. A lot of people like to use the quick selection, the other one the lasso. But I think for a good selection, you need to use the pencil as the most precise. And uh, yes, of course. And uh, now I need to make a selection. I will right click make a selection good there we go after my selection i will duplicate it and i'll go on this mask and this one i will right click and apply layer mask so i will select that layer and now i will go on filter and i will choose liquify the first thing i need to say sorry and all my apologizes to the creator of this photos because what I'm about to do is something that can be really creepy and that can look badass because I want to make this guy look like a villain and I hope the smile will be super cool on his face mm. I think so I think yes well, well, no, no. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I know, but it will make sense in the future, so get your photos ready, cause I will make you smile just like this guy. Of course, I will make you smile, just like so. And to be honest, this is the most charming smile I have seen so far. If we don't compare the smile with the Joker smile, I feel this one looks terribly awesome. So it's time to make his eyes brighter, so I'll use the exposure, rise it up on the top, invert the mask and try to paint in his eyes to make it brighter, it will look much more like a villain if I make it just brighter like so, just painting around softly, and there you go man, wow, it, it, it looks really bad me thinking that it wouldn't work but i feel it's good now it's time to have a head on his head and well, let me uh, hold up hold up i feel there is not much space i need to grab quite a bit and try to make it quite big to make it fit correctly i think so it will give a cold vibe to all this composition i'll try to make flip it horizontally just to match with the lights coming from the right uh, right I think yes of course it's right and oh yes I think it's charismatic and a good shadow just below the head using an exposure will make much sense because it will look more natural because it will not gonna be like it's floating all around and man just a simple question man you are a girl on your apartment and someone knocking to the door and is this guy you don't know that you go on the door open it and you see what you gonna do mm, really interesting me i think i will stream the name of god in the 99 languages because i don't really know what i will do i will have a quick background just to see how it looks like it looks awesome and i feel i will give a name to this guy and i feel it will be mm, bob bob seems to be the right one for this guy if you enjoy this video please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to this channel to see more video cool like this and i will see you guys for the next part of this manipulation so peace